G'day everybody, I've just jumped off a treadmill here in the Burke Street Mall, I'll come to that in a moment. More importantly, I want to talk about uh, the spike in the weather at the moment. The fire season's not over at all, uh, evidenced by a, a significant incident at Sebastopol and Mount Clear earlier in the week. So we're not out of the fire season yet, so we need everybody to, to keep vigilant. Fire restrictions have come off in some municipalities in the north and the west of the state, but we need to continue to urge Victorians to stay vigilant, monitor their local conditions, know their surroundings, and only burn off if it's safe and legal to do so. We know that over this weekend, people will be out enjoying the great outdoors of Victoria, and sometimes they want to use campfires. Make sure we push the message about those. People need to only use campfires if they have to. Make sure they're safe, and make sure they're completely extinguished and never leave them while they're burning. And while they're out and about on the roads, we encourage people to be really, really safe, take regular breaks and drive to the conditions we don't want that road toll to increase over Easter. Great to be here in the mall today, as I mentioned, just jumped off the treadmill for the uh, Good Friday appeal. That's coming up tomorrow. And uh, there'll be a lot of our people out and about on the roads and we want everyone to remain safe. And look, child safety is a natural extension of that. We'll have a lot of children involved tomorrow. We're actually collecting for children. So if you see something that you think's not right, doesn't feel right, doesn't look right, talk to your ops manager, report it up straight away. It's so important to take care of our kids. And uh, you would all have heard earlier in the week that our CEO, Paul Smith, has uh, resigned from CFA to take up a fantastic opportunity for him personally uh, at um, uh, working on climate change with the state government. Um, Paul's been with us 14 months. We're sad to see him go, but he's done some great foundation work for us, particularly as we move to a values-based organisation. So we wish Paul all the very best in his new career. And finally, we know we're heading into a federal election and we're just a reminder everybody that as CFA members we need to remain apolitical so just avoid uh, wearing um, political advertising with CFA equipment on CFA properties or on your uniform so take care out there over Easter if you get the opportunity to come down to the Burke Street Mall today and make a donation to the charity event do so and good luck and stay safe out in the roads while we're collecting a Good Friday appeal.